history degree. I'm better than this. I don't belong here. I should be doing something. Can I just stop you for a second? I think I think the problem might be that you're in the wrong fucking uniform. Like, why, why do you have that? It's... I didn't get my shirt. Okay, and this is the I mean, only thing I have. But but you have a fucking dolphin. I, I would never want I would never want donuts from you. Why would I trust some stranger with a dolphin and what is that? C CSI? Uh, you, you gonna investigate the donuts before you put them out? Like, uh, what is that? Well, you know what? Fuck you. I at least have a job. You're an asshole. Oh, holding down the donut job, are we? I'm so glad for you, Seth. Looks like that history decree's got you some real prospects. You know what? It does. Just not right now. That's all. Yeah? When? I'm working my way up. You got a degree? And now what? I'm thinking. And I've got my night class anyway. It's, yeah, it's only one class, but it's getting me there. It's, uh, oh, you're getting there, Seth. You're such a dick. figured out what I want to do. I'm going to be a sanitation man. It's perfect. Absolutely perfect. It's easy. I pick a bag up, throw it in the back of the truck, and pull a lever. It's simple. How can this be wrong? The pensions are great. Pay is great. I get vacation days. This is perfect. So much better than what I'm doing now. Well, it looks like it's your lucky day. You're going to start your on-the-job training very soon. Because guess who threw out their keys? I didn't throw out... How do you know I got threw out my keys? What do you mean, what? I mean, like, it's not like you, you came in and it was jingling. I, mean, I didn't hear any sound effect or anything, you know? My pants are tight. They wouldn't jingle. How do you how do you know like like the the threshold between like when the pants would jingle and when they wouldn't? You know what I mean like like what with a certain amount of tightness and then there stops being jingling? Like you don't even know laws of are you a science major? No, but what does it matter? I just I want to know how you know I throw out my keys. What are you a psychic? What? So I was so what if I was I was at your job right and like an idiot you threw out the fucking donut and I see you as you reached in. Yo, know, I'm good. I don't have to tell you this. Just know that you threw out the keys, all right? You were at my job and watched me throw out my keys and didn't tell me. Do you see what's wrong with this pick? Those are my work keys. Problem. Big um, problem. Yeah, but you hate that place anyway. I mean, you hate the place, so I figured you throw out the keys would be an excuse not to show up, you know? I did you a favor if you really think about it. Yes, you did me a wonderful favor. See? Now you see the right you see it the right way. Sarcasm. It's sarcasm. Did you learn that in college at your one credit night class? Listen, that class is legitimate, okay? <laughs> what was it? What was it? Um, correct me if I'm wrong. What was it? Greco Roman art 
slash what was it? It was like so they're painting naked wrestlers. That that's the legit class. I'm not painting them. I'm learning. I'm learning the ways it happens. It's perfectly legitimate. Everyone's doing it. Yeah, it's the latest fucking trend. You know what? Screw you. I am now going to look for my keys. Thank you. If you watched the news during the 80s, you probably heard of the crack baby epidemic, but a new study says the whole scare was probably overblown. Here's a taste of the news coverage back then. These children, who are the most expensive babies ever born in America, are going to overwhelm every social service delivery system that they come in contact with throughout the rest of their lives. During the crack baby episode... Oh, what the fuck? There's only one? Why wasn't there two? 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 Why wasn't What the fuck is going on? What? What? What's happening here? What, what does it look like, man? It's a big deal. We drop this one. What are you looking at? Man, fuck the small talk. I got two grand on. I'm mugging on a two grand. Yeah. Let's go. Alright, I'm in. I'm in. Let's I'm this. mugging? What are you doing? What? We're watching the news. Why is he putting two grand on a mugging? He knows the guy. The fuck is this? Why? Well, I think this is a good deal. What, you don't think it's a good deal? No! What, what, would, you like to, would you like to fucking call Crime Stoppers? Beat up by some garbage men. Yeah, that's good. Hydrogen peroxide. Alcohol. Antibiotic. Hair reliever. Deep clean. Rubber cement. Give me the fiber over there. Uh, Alright, wax, yes. And max hold. Damn, I'm good. Wait, what about Seth?
Oh, he's all right. Took care of him. What are the odds? Welcome to my office, my palace. So, well, what is this uh, urgent thing you got to talk to me about? Enough of this small ball. Got to play the major leagues. Mm -hmm. All right. So we got to go big. I'm talking major big. I thought, I thought $2,000 on a, on a mugging in the was big. How Mike, Mike, go? Mike, 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 Mike. Listen, it's one of those, this one of those uh, you only live once moments, all right? YOLO, major YOLO. All right, so what I need to know from you, I don't need to know anything else. All I need to know is are you going to jump in? Are you going to stay on the sidelines or are you going to jump in the jungle? I'm jumping in the jungle. Yeah. Yeah, so why are you so confident about this? All right, I've been betting on the same horse. I'm going to switch things up. Yeah, so which horse is this? Assault. Mm. Cut out my alley. I'm into yeah. muggins. I'm yeah. Usually assaults come with muggins. It's a little different, but are you telling me, you tell me you're a one-trick pony? So all you could do is assault? No. I'm a one-trick stallion. Yeah? Yeah. I'll take the sucker bet. I'll take the sucker bet. I'm gonna end up sleeping on that two train I'm betting on, Will. That's Rotsy right there, the zebra with his buddy Casper the pony. Causing trouble, their owner left the gate to their pen open and the duo went on the lamb, dodging traffic and looking for adventure until they were nabbed about an hour later. The, their owner blames it on the pony, apparently it was Casper's third attempted escape. Pickpocket. <laughs> right now on Fox 5 News at 6. This just in. Local Staten Islander said to have been severely beaten by a garbage man while another individual fled him away from the scene. The victim is said to have been a short white male with thick framed glasses, a beard, and it appeared to be wearing a plaid shirt. While the man fleeing him away from the scene is said to have been Filipino, also male, wearing glasses. If you see these two, please report them to the police hey, the as they are well? in need of medical attention. I don't believe in coincidences.